Phil Kewen. Just like to say how excited I am to be joining AFA President Mark Bynum, the AFA Board and the broader AFA team. Of course, I'm no stranger to the AFA community, having been a member for the last 12 years, including my time as an advisor. Through its members, the AFA has been providing great advice to Australians for more than 70 years. And to continue this, we need a strong, growing advice profession. As an association, we need to be an advocate. We need to provide leadership. And I'd like to share with you a few key areas that we're going to focus on. And the first is on the area of the AFA community. This sharing of best practice and knowledge, sharing innovation and technology. And I'd personally like to thank all of you who are currently involved in the communities of practice and the work you do to bring the community together. The next is around the area of professionalism and our transition to a highly engaged professional body. We want to partner with you to help you take the path that best suits you to ensure growth and ensure we retain the rich experience that exists within the AFA. And lastly, around the area of advocacy. We have a voice. We are a well-respected member of the community. We need to play a role in the dialogue around legislation, financial literacy and community wellbeing. And importantly, the dialogue has to be positive, it has to be around thought leadership and inspiration. And nothing can be more inspirational than the advice you provide to everyday Australians all the time. It's a powerful privilege. The AFA ultimately is here for its members and ensure clients' best interests are looked after. There will be challenges ahead, but we're looking forward to partnering with you to meet those challenges and helping to adapt to change. It's an exciting journey ahead and I'm looking forward to sharing it with you.